Hi, I'm Rhys from LB Foster, and I'm going to show you a bit about our informed content. First up, we've got CIS. This is our live passenger information powered by Tiger with failure to Darwin. This includes as the three screenshots show below departures, arrivals, next direct or fastest trains, and a platform specific display. In the software, we give you the ability to hide any imminent services within a certain amount of minutes of departure. This functionality allows you to pull the same CIS data as you see on the big screen and add it onto a mobile totem. What we see here is our CIS departure screen cycling around in a live situation. As you can see, we've got calling points. These can also be changed to paging or vertical. You can see you have the relative top logos, you've got time of departure, destination, the platform, and the expected time. If you've also got a delay to the line, it'll also show you the delay reason. Next up is our live route status maps. We'll take any of your lines, design them into a nice looking map, as you can see in the three screenshots below. For example, you use the Huddersfield and the Green Tree maps. We can show information which we currently pull from the Tyrell feed for multiple tocks. We show any instant that's passed to us as a disruption. We'll light them up yellow or red, dependent on the severity of the incident. We'll then see what the middle page shows. We see a details page which shows you the reason behind the disruption, the impact, and any customer advice passed through. We can also display to the customer the more information section at the bottom, which gives them a Twitter account, maybe a phone number, and any generic message you'd like to pass across. As you can see from the live examples we're showing on the screen, there are currently no instances of the station, so some of the map will be highlighted, and we'll still show a progress bar along the bottom, which moves along. Should there be an instant here, it would then move on to the next page at that point. Once the blue line reaches the end, it will pass across and continue into other content the customer has scheduled. Next up is our inform messaging. Simple, powerful interface to send operational messages to screens with the correct branding. As you can see from the three screenshots below, we do all the branding for you. All you have to do is go onto the server, put in the text, and it will appear on screen as you'd expect to see it below. We can give you text and images, there's profanity filters included, and template creation. Next, I'll show you an on screen example of how it appears on the screen with the animation and then how it goes on to the next piece of media. So the message comes up, this one includes an image, the text then animates in from the right hand side. This particular example has an NFC logo at the bottom. And then once the message is finished, it moves on to the next piece of passive content. Next up is the social media pages we can provide. You can show tweets and Facebook posts from your official company accounts. This automatically scrolls, shows images, and it filters out any replies. So the only content seen is original posts. If I drag a live example into the screen now, be a at tweets from network rail, and you can see it scrolling down the nice widget. Shows all the tweets from the network rail account and shows any images attached to those as well. 